I've got a question for you. I know they, they all have a lot of questions, but I have a question for So, this one's for Ravi Garu. You have offended 100 crore Hindustanis. Can you tell me? Yeah. You have said in an event, and I'm very angry with you. You can see it in your face. You said that you are the biggest fan of Rai Bachchan. Sir, what are the rest of the people? We are also fans of our childhood. Yes, sir. Look, check, check, check. हम सब एक ही हैं ना कैसे कैसे आपका भी बाल सफेद है मेरा भी बाल सफेद है ना वो कैसा अलग होगा कलर ऐसे मैं बोलना चाहता हूँ कि जो भी है अश्विनी जी की फैन सब एक ही है हमारा मंजिल एक थैंक यू Thank you so much for sharing that with me. Lay around us, Sunil Bhai. Okay, take this. Thank you. All right. So, yes, this one's for you, the very gorgeous lady here. Uh, you've been this very, very important part of the first bit. And there was a surprise entry. Everybody loved it. And you didn't come to Mumbai. You were not here. But here, now, when you are in Mumbai, what do you have to say to all the wonderful people who are here to see you, meet you? My mic's working? Yes. All right. Okay. Hi, all. Uh, April 28th is the release. See you in theatres. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you have to say thank you so much for coming here. You know, it's, it's wonderful to be in Mumbai. Are they know that I'm very thankful. I'm very, very lucky to be sitting here. I'm very, very lucky to be part of this film. Right. Thank you yeah. so much for saying thank that, you. for sharing that. Uh, of course, Shobita, thank you so much for being here. And last time, you didn't come here. But, you know, on completion of 50 days of this movie, when 500 crore ka record tore diya tha, you had posted something on the internet that actually set the internet on fire. It was a picture of all of you. Of course, Aishwarya ji usme nahi thi. Abhi is samay kon kon si memories leke jane wale ho ab when when we've come to PS2 ka ant. Um, hi everyone. Um, we've had such a beautiful time shooting uh, the both parts together and the promotions. I know often actors feel like Are, promotions, thaka, ye wo, yeah. but it's actually been uh, a beautiful experience because everyone has responded so positively and with such uh, respect for the film and the making yes. that it's really a joy and, and a film is only complete when, it's, when it has um, eager audiences. Yes. That's, that's one half of uh, filmmaking, the way I see it. Yeah. Um, it's been a beautiful response and that, I think that has really rejuvenated us. Yes. And through the course of promotions, all of us became uh, much closer. So I have great memories to take with me. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much for sharing that. Trisha, ma'am, this one's for you. Please tell us, first of all, you're looking gorgeous. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, is planet pe aap, I, ho, I, I can just go on and on with that. Tell us, tell us something about this journey. How much of it is... That that will remain with you. Like, konsa aisa hissa hai jo aapke sang amesha rehne wala hai. And what are you gonna miss the most about this amazing cast and crew? Good evening. Thank you all for coming here, supporting us. It's so nice to see you all again. And uh, too many memories yeah. that I will cherish forever. Firstly, um, back home, I haven't been part of any multi-star. So the only time, you know, I get to meet everybody at one go is probably. Uh, an award function or something else, you know, we don't really meet that off, yes. often otherwise. But this was like shooting with a whole bunch of talent every day for 130 days. And like Shobita said, the promotion part of it w is what got us closer because on set we were all a little stressed and whether wondering whether our clothes were right and hair was right and whether most importantly we were delivering our dialogues okay and you know. But um, it's been so special. So I think all of us have had uh, very emotional moments over the last week where we're either laughing like crazy people or we're breaking down and crying and then the other person starts crying <laughs> and uh, uh, Ash was party to it today as well. <laughs> yeah, I mean, so... Thank God, okay. I thought someone fell. Mic drop, yeah, that's the... So, um, I'm going to take home some really special memories, pictures, and uh, 
it's not going to fade away anytime soon because um, I mean, I will, I, I will always cherish this and I don't know if I can actually go on another set and there'll always be withdrawal symptoms of not having these guys around, you know, because I'm only probably working with one co-star right. out there. So it's been, it's, I'm privileged and of course, again, like Aishu said, so privileged to be on this stage, yeah. sharing this stage with so many wonderful people. Thank you so much. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, Aishwarya Rai Bachchan, Zordar Talia, come on. So Aishwarya, ma'am, this one's for you. You know, everybody, you know, all the biggies, everybody is going to be saying that, you know, I am like, and everybody's claiming that they are like your biggest fans. If, if we talk about you, are you an Aishwarya Rai Bachchan fan? That's a real rare, sorry. <laughs> With due respect, that's a random what, question. No, <laughs> what is that one thing that, that you feel is most amazing about Aishwarya Rai Bachchan? The actor. You have to. Uh, Ravi will say, Ravi will say. Ravi is a big fanboy, no? He'll say. Certainly not a megalomaniac to be answering this question. <laughs> <laughs> but kuch to hoga na, jo log dekh rahe See, I'm not going to let you go away with this question. What is that one thing, maybe in this character, Nandini? Well, definitely it's characters, it's, it's the work. Firstly, uh, good evening and uh, namaste and uh, thank you for being with us this um, evening. Thank you for your love, thank you for your support, thank you for your appreciation for this film, which is so precious to us. So I couldn't uh, start answering the question without expressing heartfelt gratitude for, your, for all your appreciation and through you uh, to our audience out there because um, your response has been overwhelming to PS1 and with great love and excitement. With great love and excitement. Yet again, with great love and excitement, we bring PS2 to you, releasing on 28th of April, and we are as excited as every one of you to watch it. Everyone here on stage, Manigaru, we can't wait to see your magic on screen. Uh, so I just had to put it out there, uh, because I would rather say all that than answer what you just asked, <laughs> being very honest. Um, you know, we, we, we're all human, we're all doing our jobs. But um, as artists, we are very, very blessed and very fortunate that we call our passion our jobs. Um, to wake up uh, every day, uh, uh, whenever you do, and to get up and go to work. In the name of work, to actually have the opportunity to experience wonderful stories being told, uh, to get to live the life of these characters who have been either written either documented, either they belong to books, like here, to literature, or whether it's fiction. Uh, we get to do that, to actually live the lives of so many people, because that's what our audience does. There's everybody or somebody out there who relates completely to each and every or a individual character that we essay there on screen, and that is the magic of cinema. Right. Now, when we get to do that under the direction of someone as magical as Manigaru, Dhanya uh, Hebe, absolutely blessed. So I'm grateful from day one when I got to face the camera, I got to uh, do so under his direction. And, um, you know, it's a very humbling experience. All this love that we receive, all this appreciation, this appreciation that we receive, it is for... Um, the characters that we have essayed, it is for the work we have done over the years, and it is not uh, a singular effort ever. It is really a cumulative effort of an entire team of um, actors, director, uh, the editor, the, 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 the music, um, the DOP, the, the cast, the crew, the technicians, the, all the, 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 the creative um, forces that come together. To have to give us the privilege of living on in celluloid, on celluloid, even beyond our time. We are very, very fortunate and blessed. And then to receive this degree of love and appreciation, Pichle Jarm ka kuch karmi hai. And we are very, very grateful for this blessing. Uh, it's very humbling, it's very overwhelming. And um, actors bhi bahut hi emotional uh, hote hai. And uh, 
you know, I mean, truly, today, by the end of today, after we've been doing all this media work, I think we're all going through these little waves of extreme emotions. Today we had, yes, mm, you, she burst into tears suddenly. Then I hear about how Jayam Ravi uh, burst into tears the other day. And uh, as we are watching the promo, we're all kind of getting, you know, glaze-eyed. And suddenly I looked at just a Mani Garu and I said, oh my God. It's almost the end. I mean, end of this journey, but we keep seeing new beginnings where we are going to have the absolute joy of, of sharing a PS2 with the audience. I mean, that's exciting. Yeah. That's very, very exciting. So gamut of emotions. And um, while I've digressed uh, a bit from what you asked, but that is what it really is all about. Yeah. Yes, uh, it's very beautiful. We are grateful, we are thankful for the love and appreciation. Um, we, we are allowed to enjoy it, we are human, but we really shouldn't believe it. I truly, I, I deep down from my soul believe that enjoy it, don't believe it. Right. You know, don't really get all of this into your head. Right. Just focus on what we do, focus on truth, reality, and Yes, we are blessed that in our reality, we receive unconditional love. And um, thank you so much, each and every one of you, for all your love and appreciation and blessings. Thank you so much for sharing all that. Zordar Talia. You know, we are feeling blessed and, and very, very privileged that you are getting to listen And you know, talking about that quality that I was saying, you've always had this heart full of gratitude for everybody around you. Because you've been saying that, and I'm sure you will say that again, be it for your quality for your cast members, for this amazing, amazing cast, or the audience. So that is what makes you so special, so amazing. Aishwarya Rai Bachchan, ladies and gentlemen. And now, moving on to Vikram, sir. Sir, the last time when you were here, you talked about Indian traditions, our heritage, and that actually started a dialogue. That video went viral and it almost broke the internet. So this, thank you so much, first of all, for that. And now, with this PS2, kya hone wala hai, sir? Because as I said, you've already started a dialogue that we, we, we should appreciate, we should love our heritage, we should take pride in it. What do you have to say? Hi Naveen, thanks for the awesome introductions that you always do. And thank you all for being here and um, I'm very grateful for the wonderful reviews and everything that you had to say about our film which pushed it even further up there. This has been a very special film for me and uh, what a man, Mr. Mani Ratnam, <laughs> working with him, our teacher, our professor, our guru. It was wonderful. It was all work and no play. <laughs> we didn't have fun at the shoot. <laughs> but we all lived a dream. And this dream is not just our dream of wanting to work with him or to be in a good film. It was a dream of 70 years to make a film, a story that everybody was dying to make into a film. And all of us are so proud to be a part of that film and that each character in that film each character has a fan club and has always had a fan club. To think that each character has now has a face and it's one of ours. And uh, I think that's, like Ash said, very humbling. But I think we can also tap ourselves on our back and thank Mani sir again for that. Thank you, sir, for that honor, that great honor. It's been wonderful working in such a beautiful film with such a lovely cast and the music by Rahman sir and Tota Dharani sir and everybody there out there, Eka, who did the costumes and... Uh, Ozzy who did my hair and the horse that helped me write properly. <laughs> I'd like to thank everyone taking a page from your book. <laughs> it was wonderful. It was wonderful. But I hate to say this. More than that, the fun we had was like we all shared just now during the PR. We had such good fun. And I think that again is borrowed from the film. It resonated because most of the fun was us talking about what happened in that film. How Manisa tortured us, killed us and made us promise ourselves every evening, I don't want to act, I'm going to stop acting with this film, tomorrow no shoot, but next morning, though it was 2 o'clock or 3 o'clock, whenever we were woken up, we just jumped out of bed and knew that we had to do this and we're doing something so special. There have been movies, there have been blockbusters, there have been big films for us, but I think this one will always hold a special place in our hearts because it's not about being a blockbuster or the, or the record breaker or whatever. It's a film, it's a story that's lived in everyone's heart and it's resonated in everyone's heart in the South, in, the, in Tamil Nadu, and to be a part of that, I think is very special. And answering your question, I'm so glad that whatever we spoke last time reached everybody. 
it's not just chola like you say it's every every state we have we have such a beautiful varied culture every state every town has its own history has its own stories and it's so nice to be part of one of those stories which has been become an epic now and i'm so glad that we are still here to continue and i'm sure you're going to love the second part because we all had a doubt when the first, when they made it into two parts first part was all about introductions will it run does it have enough juice and i was personally a little worried i was saying oh my god oh my god and and i was i was talking to my other my crew members during the dubbing and they said so second part is what has the story is it going to work and i was i was i had i was all smiles and i was confident and all that was happening but i was a wee bit tense inside but after that response i mean i just can't wait to see the second part and let me promise you that not just me all of us here maybe with the exception of mr rahman is going to watch this film not as a cast member but as the audience as a fan of mani ratnam sir and rahman sir and all the other stalwarts in this film it's a great film and i just can't wait to watch the magic on screen thanks again sir can't thank you enough i'll bore you with my thanks but thank you and thank you once again for being such a huge support for us thank you very much sahab we've all heard and we are in love with that anthem ps2 anthem please tell us something about that uh it's always uh, a great honor working with him mr maniratnam this great cast and this movie is going to be a bookshelf movie you know you're going to people are going to see it for the next 50 years yes and it's made like that and they're all performed like that every one of them it's amazing so i'm great to be a part of that kind of experience um working with gulzar sahab again it's like home you know you sense of confidence sense of trust sense of security which when it comes with gulzar sahab and he loves working with us we had a great interviews in the afternoon um so there no communication actually you just send the words he has done his research he's got all the stuff and the tune comes in so only very rarely we said oh can we change that word because can we reverse that sentence so those so there's no like i don't like this change this nothing he sent me one thing there are too many words can you put some more music <laughs> so it's been beautiful it, yeah and anyone and everyone who's associated with this project is exceptional you we have to you know give it to 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 the entire cast and crew ek bar zordar taaliyan ho jaye and then we'll take the media uh, questions before before we do that uh, I believe uh, Karthi bhai you have a flight yes, hai na to jaate jaate if you'd like to say something to all these wonderful people here I mean all I have to say is a lot of thanks um like I said um, hope I don't cry <laughs> <laughs> it's quite emotional to say bye bye and um, it's been wonderful being with you guys we love you Karthi we love you we love you very much all right bye bye chip wow that's a that's a pretty emotional moment ladies and gentlemen give it up for this gentleman here zordar taliya okay so we we you know public demand hai ekdam abhi nahi jaane de sakte hai so quickly if you want to shoot a couple of questions for karthi sir ho jaye where where are we taking the first question from there Yes, come on. Go ahead. Can we do it like a little quickly? Yeah. Lovely. Hmm. Any questions for Karthi? No, no, no. Oh, no, no. We want you to answer a couple of questions. Vikram sir. Thank you. We have beer. We have beer. Who needs a mic? Sir, you can reach me. Any money, sir? Right. Cool. Thank you so much. Three of us. Come. कार्ती कार्ती मेरा सवाल आपसे एक है इस फिल्म में आपको इस फिल्म में आपको दिलों का राजा कहा गया है उसको आप किस तरह से डिफाइन करते हैं अपने कैरेक्टर के साथ दिलों का राजा सब्टाइटल्स प्लीज 
அதாவது கிங் ஆஃப் ஹார்ட்ஸ் கிங் ஆஃப் ஹார்ட்ஸ் ஸோ வெல் இட்ஸ் ஸோ பியூட்டிஃபுல் ரிட்டன் த ஒன் லைன் இஸ் அ ஃபென்டாஸ்டிக் and uh, it's not so difficult to romance these beautiful ladies also no you don't have to really try hard it naturally comes when you look at them and then of course when i overdo it mani sir is there to control me so i look more charming you know <laughs> i don't overdo it and stay cool you know sometimes i get to just get excited too much looking at them but then sir keeps me on control and then you should remember that raman sir is playing music for me behind so all my look becomes even more better because of that music so i think all king of hearts are sitting here actually <laughs> i'm trying <laughs> i'm not i'm not getting good marks there <laughs> i'm trying because raman sir is not getting music for me exclusively <laughs> i'll take It'll it back personally <laughs> and play it at home cool thank you thank, thank you, you so, so much karthi sir thank you so much zordar taliya ho jaye come on for this gentleman here bye pa safe landing yes ma'am hi a very warm welcome to this cast to bombay uh, my question is for our uh, chian sir and ashwarya uh, so uh, like everybody spoke about uh, that you know how you enlightened us with the knowledge about indian heritage as the, is a beautiful piece of literature what is your favorite part from this literature <laughs> <laughs> i love the unrequited love between nandini and aditi karikal and i think it's it's a very very different kind of love i have romanced a lot of people in a lot of movies it's always been one sided love or you love both of it's mutual but this is the first time that there's one person who loves him so much he can kill him and oh. there's this other person who loves her so much he can die for her and what happens then and does he die because of her i don't know or does he live you don't know that is a very beautiful thought and in the book too it almost has an it's not finished it's left there it's for us to conjure up some image in our minds and manisha has wrapped it up so beautifully and i just love it and working with her was phenomenal i loved it and once again it was nice sharing screen screen space and that chemistry with her Thank i completely you, echo uh, his sentiments and um, who better than to actually uh, bring that kind of dynamic on celluloid than manigaru he is king of uh, bringing romance into the most tense moments in <laughs> in a manner which is just so unique to his uh, st- his storytelling his uh, way of bringing magic that pain becomes beautiful you see love you see intensity and the ab- ultimate romance in the moments that uh, when written on paper does not read like that but is definitely experienced like that and uh, we're so fortunate to have had the you know to to have that creative opportunity to uh, to live those moments thank you it's truly magical i have an extension to this question for you ashwarya uh, how did you get into this space of nandini who's smitten everyone you know now when it was on screen there was a sense of proud you know proud is that yes this is someone right here so how did you get in space you know Isn't in my space is that amazing first to begin with in kalkisa's writing yeah. that this lady is just so um the way she's been written in as a character and as a personality um it's just amazing that all the women also in the audience apart from i mean i mean the readers to begin with uh absolutely love this character there's a strange relatability strange because uh i think deep down all of us know that um, we are gray this is not black and white everybody is gray everybody uh, is layered as a personality and um, and that's just the, the deepest truth so in life actually um there are no labels there is no compartmentalization about uh, being a protagonist or an antagonist or are you are you positive or are you negative these these are all labels that i think we as people go about um, attaching to personalities we all have all the aspects and all the dimensions and we are reactionary so a lot of what we do and who we are and how we it's 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 so often reactionary it's very and most often emotional uh, uh, the triggers are are experiences and very deeply emotional experiences and that's what so often can be the driving force 
for choices that you make in your life. And I think that's that's the core that's that makes her so relatable. And um, I'm, uh, when Mani Garu uh, narrated the film to me and said, Nandiniya, oh my God. <laughs> I was like, really? I, I love it. He's a man of, we all have said this all day, man of few words, which you're just also experienced. But that one word is enough. You know, he say one word, a look and a nod, and that even that little ah uh, that follows. <laughs> you know, there's so much said in that. It was just a natural yes, and I'm so, so thankful I got to essay um, his Nandini and uh, be a part of... Uh, this um, amazing, magical, uh, immensely memorable, and personally very deeply uh, treasured movie experience for me as an artist and each and every one of us here. So eternally grateful that I got to be his Nandini. His Nandini. <laughs> Hello. My question is that in the way of your and Mani Sir's relation, a trust, a love, a confidence, you can see it on the page of the page. When the film comes to you with Mani Sir, तो वो सिर्फ नाम ही काफी होता है या कहानी किरदार उन सब को भी आप ढूंढती हैं देखती हैं <laughs> गुरु भक्ति गुरु है मेरे तो मतलब एक तो सबसे पहले इट्स अ नेचुरल यस हाँ तो है ही जब भी हिंट हिंट सर <laughs> जब भी पूछेंगे ज़रूर जवाब हाँ ही होगा दैट्स अ गिवन अब उसे श्रद्धा कहें गुरु भक्ति कहें कृतज्ञता कहें या प्यार कहें यू कैन लेबल इट व्हाट यू वांट बट द पॉइंट इज़ दैट इट वुड ऑलवेज बी अ यस बट व्हाई वुडंट इट बी अ यस आई एम वेरी फॉर्चुनेट आई थिंक anybody any actor you you speak to anyone who has had the opportunity to work with him or who hasn't as yet deeply aspires to work with him uh, actors and all creative forces bahut excitement rehti hai pata nahi kitne log dikhate hain ya nahi lekin bahut khushi hoti hai bahut excitement hoti hai aaj uh, when we were giving interviews earlier also we were being asked and everybody said that if if a message or even that name flashes on the phone or you uh, sir now we are telling you directly you cannot imagine the excitement we have shared it unabashedly <laughs> during interviews today in the day bahut khushi hoti hai bahut excitement hoti hai or and everybody truly looks forward to uh, getting the opportunity to work with him or mauka mile so it is very deeply treasured it is very very um, uh, really cherished respected it's a learning curve it is an experience which is unique to itself and um, it shows um, uh, in the reaction of the audience of you viewers i mean it's all good. So, I mean, why, why wouldn't one say a natural yes? Lekin, khubi inki hai ki it's so lovely. In fact, he said that to me recently when I was asking him, sir, how? I was asking him the context of others. You know, when we were just talking, I said, sir, sometimes you kind of wonder, should one take that call or not, you know? Say yes or not. And I've never spoken to him about this before directly, and I did, I did only very recently. Uh, after we finished Ponyan, no, sir? And um, he just said the sweetest thing. He said, um, you know, which it's always been, be honest about how you feel about the character you're going to essay. Even if it is me, don't just say yes. I said, no, I mean, you've always brought something magical. Bhale Iruvar ho, Guru ho, Ravan, Ravanan or Rab, Ponyan Selvan. I mean, you've always brought something magical. So it's a natural yes, of course. He said, but even then, you've got to be honest about how you feel about the character that you're going to go essay because you are going to live that character and you're going to bring that character to life. There has to be an honesty and integrity and a commitment which runs beyond just, I'm going to say a yes, but of course. But I'm going to say a yes, but of course. <laughs> I will always just say a yes, but of course. It's him. Everything else is already set. Everything else is already in place. Thank you. Hi, Hi Aishwarya ji, is, on uh, your left. Hi. ऐश्वर्य जी ये जो नंदिन नंदिनी नाम है क्या इस नमस्ते ये जो नंदिनी नाम नाम है क्या इससे आपका कुछ इमोशनल कनेक्शन है और एक फिल्म आई थी नंदिनी जो लोगों ने ऑडियंस ने बहुत ही प्यार दिया बहुत ब्यूटीफुल कोइंसिडेंस ना 
इट्स अमेजिंग ना कि ऐसा हुआ भी है आई मीन इन फैक्ट येस इवन नंदिनी इन हम दिल दे चुके सनम वॉज वेरी वेरी मेमोरेबल शी हेज लिव्ड ऑन इन पीपल्स हार्ट्स एंड आई एम सो सो थैंकफुल दैट आई गॉट टू प्ले नंदिनी देन टू एंड शी इज रिमेन्ड स्पेशल फॉर द ऑडियंस एंड ऑफ कोर्स टू मी एंड टूडे एंड दैट वॉज इट संजय बंसाली जी and today of course with my money garu i got to play nandini in ponian selvan i mean that's that's just tremendously uh, a blessing uh, to have gotten to play such strong women such uh, layered women and uh, women with um, with character that touches the lives of so many women out there there is a relatability so i'm very 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 grateful you whatever film you make you try to make it as well as you can but when you make a period film and when it is a uh, historical though it's a historical fiction once it's an historical thing you try to go as close as you can to what could have been and not fantasize it not uh, add elements which are not too real but try to bring it you know as close to reality as possible this film was treated in that fashion and the objective while making was simple that uh, it should look like it is happening now or it should look like we are there next to the characters so it was shot it was scored it was put together it was performed casually not like a historical drama so everything added to that hi Hi, Ashwarya, ma'am, Prabhat from Bollywood Chronicle. This side, right side. Ma'am, this side, Which right. Side? Left, left side, ma'am. Left, yeah. Right. Here, there, yeah, there. Yeah. Okay, yes. Hello, hello, namaste. Ma'am, social media revolution is a big boon for celebrities, common people. But I mean, nowadays, the irrelevant news content being circulated, do you feel like it's nice. you know hurting people? I mean, sentimentally or emotionally, and it, there should be a stoppage on this kind of a thing. Sorry, what is the question? I, 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 I heard the comment, and I think everybody has nodded here on stage on uh, what are about, the possibilities. I'm, yeah, yeah, I am talking about the irrelevant news content being circulated on social media. But it's so nice that a person, a member of the media only, is recognizing that that does exist. So uh, that gives us a great hope that you're obviously not going to perpetuate that. You're not going to, uh, you know, encourage that. And thank you very much for your wise recognition of the, you know, the negative impact of uh, false uh, writing or unnecessary writing, which is insensitive and unnecessary. So thank you so much for your support. for that sentiment that we all share and for your wisdom in recognizing that um good evening good evening uh, team ps1 i'm vijalakshmi from uh, the free press journal uh, my question is to mani sir and to rahman sir um, gentlemen uh, straight straight good evening sirs um, my question to both of you is uh, you all have collaborated with each other for almost 3 decades and you all have been friends um and you all have given tamil cinema some of the most landmark films that we all know every time you all collaborate with each other my favorite question to ask especially with two individuals who collaborate often with each other is how do you bring a sense of newness to every project that you undertake because the subjects are very different <laughs> yes sir money sir first yeah okay it's it's very easy with rema next to me it's not very difficult to ask for something new and uh, i think to a large extent both of us uh try to keep in mind that try to explore new areas you know and not try to repeat what we have done before and stay as far as possible from that and to a large extent also that the, the kind of films that we are doing dictates a kind of music that uh, you no know, was demanded and within that rahman is capable of experimenting go far away and give something absolutely fresh and uh, so it's been i've been lucky thank you sir rahman sir 
So I'm like a supermarket. I do super commercial <laughs> movies. I do a symphony orchestra, and then I do classical kind of songs. But here there's a special shop. <laughs> it's always there for me so far. I've been very lucky. So I do all this mischief outside, and come here to do all the innovation. So I can go wild, and he'll put me in Just place. Go me food and stuff. <laughs> like <a> special. Stuff. <laughs> hello, uh, hello. Yeah, pe, yeah, pe. इधर 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 यार 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 सेंटर गाइस टेक योर फोन एंड फ्लैश योर लाइट्स आई थिंक शी इज देयर द सेंटर हेलो मेरा नाम आरती सक्सेना है और मेरा ऐश्वर्या जी से क्वेश्चन है जी नमस्ते लास्ट uh, टाइम मैंने ऑप्शंस दिए थे आपको अमित जी के बिग वो केबीसी के लेकिन इस बार नहीं दूंगी <laughs> तो इस बार मेरा ये सवाल है कि आजकल साउथ बॉलीवुड पे छाया हुआ है लाइक साउथ की रीमेक्स बन रही हैं साउथ की डब बन रही हैं और वो हिट हो रही हैं और बॉलीवुड वाले जितने रीमेक बना रहे हैं वो फ्लॉप भी हो रहे हैं तो ये बात आपको पहले से पता थी आप साउथ की तरफ पहले ही भाग ली भागी साउथ की फिल्में ज़्यादा कर रही हैं बॉलीवुड के हिसाब से I mean it's not about because I think मेरा जो नज़रिया रहा है भारतीय सिनेमा है शुरू से एंड आई वॉज वेरी वेरी क्लियर अबाउट आई मीन इफ आई हैड दी ऑपरचुनिटी ऑफ कोर्स टू बी एबल टू सटली बट स्ट्रॉगली एंड क्लियरली कन्वे दैट इन द वर्क दैट आई डिड राइट फ्रॉम द बिगिनिंग बिकॉज आई डो नॉट आई नेवर आई डो नॉट सपोर्ट दैट व्यू पॉइंट कि यू नो यहाँ काम नहीं है तो वहाँ जाएंगे वहाँ काम नहीं है तो यहाँ आएंगे ऐसी कोई बात है नहीं कलाकार कला के पीछे जाता है जहाँ मौका मिले कि वी गेट दी अपॉर्चुनिटी टू शाइन टू लर्न टू ग्रो टू बी एबल टू डू फैबुलस वर्क इट्स अ नेचुरल यू नो इट इट नेचुरली ड्रॉज यू एंड इवन इफ वी साउंड रिपेटेटिव एंड इट इट बोर्स यू द फैक्ट इज दैट आई वॉज ब्लेस टू हैव दी अपॉर्चुनिटी टू वर्क विद मणि गारू इन माई फर्स्ट फिल्म वाई वुडेंट आई से येस एंड येस एंड देर आफ्टर आई ऑल्सो गॉट टू वर्क विद वंडरफुल डिरेक्टर्स लाइक राजीव मैन एंड शंकर सर इट वॉज नेचुरली आई वुड से येस टू द द मूवीज दैट आई हैव डन एंड the the proof is in the pudding you'll have seen the movies that i have chosen to do with uh, rehman sir's music in all of them i mean wow why why wouldn't i happily say a yes to these incredible combinations of talents where i got to uh, start my my career to grow to learn and have the opportunity to actually work with the great talents you know when you have the opportunity to to surround yourself to infuse yourself with this kind of creative energy इट्स अ नेचुरल ये सो इट्स नॉट अबाउट यहाँ भागना कि वहाँ भागना शुरू से मैंने तो आई थिंक काफ़ी क्लियर किया है इन माई चॉइसिस की आई डोंट फॉलो दीज सिस्टम्स एंड दीज थाट प्रोसेस एंड यू नो दैट्स दैट्स नेवर बीन माई जर्नी एंड रीजन फॉर माई चॉइसिस Thank you. Thank you. Sorry for. All right, we'll take hello, hello. final questions, right? <laughs> I'll, hello, I'll hello. Come to you, yeah. but before that, Mayur. Uh, hi, uh, Mayur here from Beyond Bollywood Center. You can see me. Yeah, I have one question for Trisha and one question for Mr. Mani Ratnam and uh, Vikram sir. Uh, I'll ask Trisha first. Uh, you know, obviously, you have this unenviable distinction. You know, you're made in Hindi film. Uh, where I've not seen it, but uh, I have read that uh, you played a municipal commissioner. So I wanted to ask you. You know, last time when you came to Mumbai and today when you've come to Mumbai, did you take stock of the roads, the potholes? Take stock, stock of the, the potholes. <laughs> That's a light-hearted question. I do that even in Chennai. <laughs> okay, the roads are good in Chennai, though. Okay, well, you want to add something? To <laughs> no, I mean um, uh, that was a film. You know, honestly, I, I did not look at it as like a launch into Hindi cinema. It was because Priyanka launched me in Tamil, and he asked me to do this film. It's actually a remake of a Malayalam okay. film, so I just obliged because. like he he's he's my guru you know he launched me he gave me a platform and so no i do not go around looking at potholes in any part of india why <laughs> okay my question to mani sir and vikram sir uh, you know lately you know especially in the last few years we get to hear this word pan india uh, the way i look at it you know india is a country it's known for its cultural diversity and uh, with cultural diversity comes different sense sensibilities you know regional sensibilities uh, so so do you think as a filmmaker Uh, do you think it's really a it's a fallacy to use this word uh, pan india because the sensibilities was always uh, 
you know, uh, they will be uh, different and that's the beauty of our nation. Yeah, I absolutely agree with you. I think we should take away the word Pan-India, it's always been India. Uh, Vikram sir, would you like to add to this? Yeah, the same. Um, first of all, apologies for the history class last time. And uh, second, uh, I, I, I believe any story, any movie with a good story, which is engaging, which is thought-provoking, which evokes emotions that really stir us, will do well, will reach uh, example, a clear example would be a Kantara or, you know, which is such a small film. But it crossed boundaries in spite of it having, you would understand that being a Mangalorean, it's got a Mangalorean culture which even people in Bangalore may not understand, which only a, a certain community in Kerala will understand. It's on the border. It's called Teyam in Kerala and whatever. But it reached cross boundaries because sheer dint of the fact that it had a story like that, which was so engaging. So I think you make good films, it will cross boundaries. And now with OTT and stuff, people have started watching films, not just dub films, they prefer watching films with subtitles because they want to have the original language out there, which is so, you know, heartwarming. And I'm so glad that we are all here in a time when we can push our boundaries and now we don't even have to stop with Kashmir or with um, Kanyakumari. We're actually thinking global. We're thinking of Oscar awards. Who knows, one of them may get, or will surely get. And we, he's making it a habit, so. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be waiting for them. Thank you for that question. Hi, Shobita. Yeah. Hi. Hi, Shobita. I'm Tanmay from Peeping Moon. Uh, my question for you is, uh, what's your biggest takeaway from PS2? Um, that uh, sometimes I feel like as actors, when an experience or when, when something is so special to you, like for me, this opportunity, sometimes we tend to put it on such a pedestal that we uh, might not entirely be present in the moment. So there have been a couple of times when uh, we shot things that I was completely uh, unprepared for, and yet taking that plunge gave me a lot of joy afterwards, and it taught me a lot. So when the student is ready, the lesson arrives. So just be willing to take the leap and have faith, um, your filmmaker knows what he's doing. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> Jayam, Jayam, Jayam Ravi, would you like to elaborate a little bit here, this side? Would you like to tell us something about your character? In the movie, right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> Otherwise, also, we won't mind. Otherwise, learning. it's a little questionable. <laughs> that's oh, a, it, but that's it, a good question. It'll be interesting. He's jealous, know? nothing. Yeah, he's always Especially jealous. Especially the questionable parts. <laughs> yeah. Uh, down south, um, I would say uh, the character of Ponin Selvan or uh, so no, Raja Raja Shodan is an epitome of a character. You know, he's literally looked as near to God because of his nature and uh, because the way he took care of his kingdom. So when Mani sir called me and told me, you're going to play Raja Raja Chodan. And I was like uh, in a dream, which we spoke uh, a few months back here. And now the dream has come as a reality. But the process was amazing. Because uh, he told me to live as Raja Raja Solo for six months before the shoot. So I did, uh, I did that uh, exercise, sir, I did. And it really helped me to play that character well. Because, you know, I was searching for many words uh, to describe uh, Raja Raja Solon. And I took all the positive words because he is a very positive person. And the one word stood out, you know, it's the righteous righteousness of him when he looks at somebody uh, you he we know that he's righteous righteous so that word uh, my brother helped me with that word and uh, finally when i portrayed it and when people saw it my brother who has like done seven films he's a director he's done seven films with me and uh, we've grown together uh, and uh, this one is he saw the film and he told I'm seeing you as a new person here. I can see the righteousness in your eyes. Mm. Only my brother can come up with that because he's lived with me, made movies with me. And uh, 
I really thank Mani sir for that, you know, for seeing that quality, something, I don't know. <laughs> thank you, sir. Thank you for that. Mani sir, uh, Mani Garu, before we wind up, do you consider uh, Ash as your lucky charm and lucky mascot? And yeah, Ash, he, you can answer also after him. He certainly not want to sit and think about luck. Is she your fan club I mean, president? I, I don't think luck even uh, is the kind of factor that he focuses on. Lucky charm. See, when you're a filmmaker is a very, very selfish person. He's absolutely <laughs> heartless and selfish. Only thing that you care for is the film. You so, second that. <laughs> how much ever I love her, I will ask her only if I think she's right for the role. Oh. And every time Vasta is only because I believe that she was absolutely right for the role and she's been nice enough to say yes. So oh. it is not a luck or it's not a charm, it's only her talent and the personality that would portray this character. Thank you so much ladies and gentlemen. Yes, that's all we have for you. <laughs>